Florian Manukin is a 30-year-old single mother of one child living in Spain. She recently found out that she was pregnant. Her reaction? When I discovered I was pregnant, I knew what I wanted, or rather what I didn't want. She spoke to us just after she'd had a procedure to terminate her pregnancy, something that she's able to do under Spanish law. But that right is now under threat. It's not right that the government takes these decisions for us. We're not talking about a car or a short-term job. It's something that affects your entire life. Spain's Association of Gynecologists also feared that it would be a backward step for women. Every prohibition of abortions uh, doesn't mean that abortions are going down. You will still have the same cases of abortions. What changes is if it's legal or illegal, is if you have safe abortions or not. The draft law would radically restrict the current terms for abortion. If the law gets passed, only women who have been raped or whose lives are in danger as a result of the pregnancy would qualify for a termination. Even then, they would need permission from two separate doctors to abort. A woman's right to choose whether or not she can have an abortion is what's at stake here. But the Justice Minister is arguing that it's just as much about the rule of law. He's arguing that the current law as it stands is anti-constitutional. And while any changes may appease the religious right wing, it's proving so controversial that even members of the ruling Conservative People's Party are voicing their own opposition to it. While the political right appeared divided on the issue, pro-life activists have been vocally campaigning for the law to go ahead. We'll do as, as much as we can. We'll keep on, uh, you know, uh, demonstrating, rallying, writing letters to the Prime Minister, um, you know, being in the media, social networks, to make sure that the um, Prime Minister understands that there is a majority of Spaniards who voted for him and who want him to uh, fulfill his commitment. While Spain is a secular country, the Roman Catholic Church does cast a long shadow over such issues. It is a strong presence in the country, but recent polls have shown most Spaniards to be against any change to the current law. The majority of the European Parliament has also condemned the move. And after years of the law supporting a woman's right to choose, this will not be an easy issue to convince the country otherwise. Sonia Gallego, Al Jazeera, Madrid.